Minneapolis mayor responded to a CARE 11 investigation today, calling it an obvious breakdown in the process and a horrible mistake. We showed you last night an innocent family was held at gunpoint in a no knock warrant raid on the wrong address. AJ Legault has the update. I was like, Wah! a Minnesota mother and daughter. Two of them had their guns up, woke up to flashlights and firearms as their house and bedroom doors were bashed in. The sound was just so quick and I just got really scared. Were they pointing guns at you? Yeah. A CARE 11 investigation revealed how Minneapolis police failed to do basic due diligence before using a no knock warrant to have the Anoka County SWAT team execute a pre dawn raid on a Coon Rapids home looking for an yeah, armed robbery suspect. The problem? The suspect had moved out 10 months ago before Bianca Mathias and her 12 year old daughter Giselle moved in. And they're like, do you know what we're here for? I'm like, no. Minneapolis Mayor Jacob Fry, whose campaign website lists among his accomplishments banning the use of no knock warrants in the city, issued a statement saying in part he's ordered an internal affairs investigation into the raid to ensure a thorough review of the facts and that any officers who failed to do basic levels of due diligence prior to the warrants issuance are held accountable. Mayor Fry also says he called Bianca and Giselle personally to apologize. You can read his statement in its entirety on care11.com. Back to you.